Okay, DRW. I'm getting sick and tired of seeing everybody bragging on how they're going to win Battle Clash. You have Blade, who is pretty much useless as a wet toothpick to be winning this match. I mean, you gotta be kidding me. Blade, you gave up on this company two freaking times. How many more times are you gonna give up on this company before you actually realize that this company actually cares for you? Then we have Firestar Heart. And uh, Firestar Heart is just, just another, uh, you know, to, He's just coming back. He's not even a threat right now. Then you got... To be honest, there's so many names in Battle Clash. It makes me, you know, rage. So, here it is. The only people who is going to be left is going to be me and Torrance. Blade, you are not in my level. You are not in Torrance's level. You will never be in our level. You can do all the crying or the moaning that you want, but you know what? You're still going to lose. You see, I was screwed out of the title last pay-per-view. I won that match fair and square, and now I get another chance? I got to win until after Torrance wins? A a after we have the DMG Angel Rivera match? I got to wait after them? Nuh-uh. You see, I have a rematch clause. I have a rematch clause. No one else has one. And every time I say I'm going to do it, no one gives me a chance. But you know what? Now, I'm going to announce. No matter who wins the DMG Angel Rivera match, I'm going to insert myself into the title match. Because I'm invoked my rematch clause. I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm just fine. You guys really think I'm going to cash in? You see, Angel Rivera is nothing but a crybaby. If he doesn't get what he wants, he's going to cry. You see, there's this big plan that I have. You see, even if I win Battle Clash, I don't care if I do or not, but you know what? Torrance, you really think that I'm going to let you take advantage of me? You're nothing to me, man. You're nothing. You see, you're in the road to glory. I'm in the road to glory or destiny, whatever we call it. But you know what? The difference is, I know how to win the big one. I won the Extreme Rumble. I won that Dark Mania. Now, I want you to understand, yeah, you might have tapped out Chris Knox, but you know what? Chris Knox is nothing but a big whiny crybaby. You see, there's a reason why I haven't invoked my rematch clause yet. And I'm going to invoke my rematch clause October 26th. October 26th is when I take back where it's rightfully mine. Now, I've been hearing rumors about a world title coming back into play. And you know what? I heard a rumor that we might be getting the world title champion crowned tomorrow at Battle Clash. That's all good and fine. Now we have this DOA, Dead on Arrival Stable, which was the NWO. Can you guys Stick with one name. Can you stay with one name, please? You see, there is nothing no one can do in DIW after the War Games match. Because after the War Games match, everything is going to be set into plan. Everything is going to be set into plan. Let's see. The clock is ticking. I'm going to be a champion again. Let's face it. As I never said on DRW Radio number 58, there is no one better than me. And Adam Rush, you were not better than me. In a way, I got rid of Austin Newhouse. 
in a way, I freed us all from Austin New Highs. So, I want you to get one thing straight, and one thing strained out, Jack. I am going to win at Battle Clash. I've been silent because I didn't care that much about Battle Clash, but now I'm getting a little irritated, and you know what? Blade and everyone else in Battle Clash, be warned, be warned ahead of time. Because I am walking out as the winner of Battle Clash. Bye.